offering up conjugal relations for clergy and those who have had abortions. Praise be to Jesus. Praise be to the Blessed Mother. 알곡으로 모이신 여러분 이렇게 함께 하게 돼서 반갑습니다. Dear all who are gathered here as good grains, I'm happy to be with you now. 80년 제가 암을 치유받 사랑하실 때 장부 윤료 씨가 저를 50% 주님께 봉헌하겠다고 했습니다. In 1980, when I was healed of cancer and came back to life, Julio, my husband, said, "I will dedicate you to the Lord 50%." 그런데 1985년 6월 30일 성모님께서 처음 눈물을 주실 때 저를 100% 온전히 주님과 성모님께 봉헌했습니다. But on June 30th, 1985, when the Blessed Mother shed tears for the first time, he offered me up to the Lord and the Blessed Mother completely 100%. 그리고 1986년 8월 10일 날. 아파트로 처음 이사 가서 저희 단둘이 잘수 있는 방이 처음 생겼을 때 그날 부부 관계를 봉헌하게 됐습니다. And on August 10th, 1986, when we first moved into an apartment and had a couple's bedroom for the first time, we offered up our cultural relations for the Lord. 여러분, 누갈다 성녀가 유명하죠? 누갈다 성녀는 결혼을 했는데 부부 관계를 안 했어요. 그렇죠. Dear all, you know of Saint Lucretius Lee, the famous virgin martyr of Korea. Saint Lucretius was married, but as you know, did not have any conjugal relations with her husband. 그리고 방에 줄을 쳐놓고 남편은 저쪽에 자고 누갈다 성녀는 이쪽에 자고 그렇게 잤다 그래요. They probably lined down the center of the room, and the husband slept on one side, and the wife Lucretius on other side. 근데 우리는 아이를 넷이나 낳았어요. In case of Julio and I, we had four children. 그리고 윤료 씨는 40대 초반에 마누라를 옆에 놔두고 한 이불 속에서 둘이 손한 번도 안 잡고 살도 안 되고. Julio, when he was 44 years old, slept in the same bed with his wife without holding hands or making bodily contact for one year. 혹시나 사료 달까 봐 양말까지 다 신고 그렇게 1년을 살았습니다. We even wore socks while sleeping to avoid accidentally touching each other's skin. Sometimes we slept with gloves on in case we touched each other's hands. I was fine doing this, but I was afraid that Julio would be sexually attracted to me again if by any chance I touched him. We lived like that for one year. As the mattress was so small in those days, we had to sleep close together. How hard it must have been for Julio as he was in his prime. 너무너무 힘들 때 그렇게 힘들어요 그러니까 당신이 다른 부인들처럼 그렇게 했더라면 나 이렇게 힘들지 않았을 거야. When I could see that he was having a really hard time of it, I would ask him, "Is it too hard for you?" If you were like such an ordinary wife, I wouldn't have had this hard time. 그런데 당신 나한테 얼마나 잘했어. 그러니 봉헌하기가 힘들지 이러더라고요. But how good you have always been to me. That is why it's difficult for me to offer it up. He said. 그래도 봉헌 잘 해주셨어요. But he has offered it up gracefully. 그때는 제가 잘 몰랐지만. 1986년 11월 1일 주님께서 성직자들이 너무나 잘못 산 것을 저에게 보여주셨어요. Even though at the time I was not aware that it was happening, on November 1st, 1986, the Lord showed me that some clergy were living so sinfully. 그런데 지금은 성직자들 더 타락해서 정말 이런 말을 할 수가 없습니다. 여러분에게 지금 말을 할 수가 없습니다. But now, most of the clergy have been more immortal, so it is really beyond description. I cannot tell you all the details now. 그래서 성직자들 위해서 또 낙대한 사람들 위해서 제가 고통을 보호했습니다. So for the clergy and for those who have had abortions, I have been offering up my sufferings. 근데 제가 그냥 고통을 보호하는 것이 아니라 남편이 혹시라도 나 생각날 때는. I did not just offer up the pain. Whenever by chance my husband would be sexually attracted to me, I wish he might offer up his pain graciously while seeing my offering up. 
주님과 성을 위해서 그리고 성립자를 위해서 또 나태한 사람을 위해서 모을 했어요. I offer my suffering for the Lord and the Blessed Mother, for the clergy, and for those who have had abortions. I lit a candle on the floor and then prayed in preparation from 8 p.m. You may know a dark razor with blades on both sides. I put razor blade over the candle flame and prayed. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death. Amen. While I was slowly reciting the Hail Mary three times, the razor blade had already heated up because it was very thin. I didn't do it quickly. After reciting the Hail Mary three times, the razor blade completely heated up through to the upper side. Then my fingers got burned and turned white. Because it was too hot to hold, meditating on the Holy Trinity for unity, I held a burning blade with one unit of small toilet paper, but the paper also got burned. Later on, I found that all my fingers were burned. And I placed the razor blade on the candle flame reciting three Hail Marys, it all heated up. When I pressed it down on my flesh, it burned with a crackling sound. I could strongly smell flesh burning. For a burning cross marks on my inner thigh with a heated blade, I prayed seven Hail Marys. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I repeated this process seven times for the vertical line of the cross. <laughs> While heating the razor blade over the candle flames, I slowly offered up another three Hail Marys. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. While pressing the hot blade down hard on my thigh to make the horizontal line, I prayed another seven Hail Marys. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I repeated this process seven times for the horizontal line of the cross. To create one cross at my thigh, I repeated these seven times for each line. And 
I made seven crosses on each thigh, meditating on the seven sorrows and seven joys of the Blessed Mother and the seven sacraments. I made a total of 14 crosses, seven crosses on one thigh and another seven on the other. I kept praying and meditating on the 14 stations of the cross by remembering Kolbotha Hill where Jesus walked each time I made one cross. Consequently, I offered 140 Hail Marys in total to complete one cross. Hence, I offered them 1,960 Hail Marys in total to make 14 crosses on my thighs. I could strongly smell flesh burning. I came out of the room after 7 a.m. to help Julia get ready to go to work. I showed Julia what I had done to myself. It was to help him to no longer have any sexual attraction in me at all. I strongly smelled of burning flesh since I burned myself for 10 hours. So I said to Julio, Julio, I burned my flesh by offering myself up. I also showed him the razor blade that I had used. Wow, he said, oh my, your spirit of sacrifice is great, and said to me, let me try to offer up with more determination. If my husband hadn't agreed with it, I couldn't have done it. Whenever he saw the crosses on my thighs, how could he approach me? I was sorry for Julio, but there are so many people who have had abortions. And also the Lord showed me a vision of the degraded clergy. While thinking on it, I offered our conjugal relations to Jesus. Jesus said, My little simple and kind baby, you console my wounded heart. Through your horrendous sufferings, I will deliver tens of thousands of aborted fetuses up to heaven, who now resent their parents in limbo. If anyone of you here have aborted your babies, please offer them up. Then your aborted babies in limbo will be raised up to heaven now. Amen. After I offered up the pace of making burn marks on my skin, or the burned area festered and discharged bloody pus, but I never applied any ointment. It took three months for the wound to partially heal and five months for them to be healed completely. <laughs> If I had applied ointment, it wouldn't have been a penance, so I didn't even apply ointment to my hands. But I continued working, including cooking. Yet I was so delighted. Dear all, let us not be too sensitive to trivial pains, but offer them up graciously. Thank you. I love you so much. I love you offering up my life entirely for you. I will live the life of loving others now. I will live the life of loving others now. 
I will live my day by day. In loving others, I live the life of loving others now. I will live the life of forgiving others now. I will live the life of forgiving others now. I will live my day by day in forgiving others. I will live the life of forgiving others now. I will live the life of rejoicing now. I will live the life of rejoicing now. I will live my day by day in rejoicing. I will live the life of rejoicing now. Amen. Amen.